Introducing first, fight out of the red corner. He stands 5 feet 5 inches tall, weighing fight time at 121.8 pounds. He has an amateur kickboxing record, an impressive one. Seven wins with just three defeats. Fighting out of Anaheim by way of Bueno Park, California. Representing Bueno Park MMA, he is the reigning Fighters Rep West Coast Featherweight Champion, David the Death Dealer Marquez. And introduces his opponent. Fighting out of the black corner. He says five feet six inches tall, weigh up fight time at 122.4 pounds. He has an extensive amateur record, an impressive one. 29 wins with just eight defeats. Fighting out of Mesa, Arizona, representing Dan's gym. This is David D. Nice Fisher. And with your final instructions, Big Mark Reyes. All right, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the back. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my command at all times. Touch him up. Good luck to the both of you. Fight fans, this is the next bout. You are going to see speed and power combined. Two fighters step across the ring from each other, both wearing a lot of hardware, wearing a lot of titles. But this one is for the fighters rep bantamweight title. Marquez rallying with the hands, high kick. Fisher peppering with that jab. Fisher looking re really fluid right off the top. David Marquez usually has that herky-jerky fighting style at times. Will be interesting to see how these styles clash as Fisher digs into the body with a left hook to Marquez. Think about Marquez, he has that power that comes out of nowhere. But both these fighters look very strong, fast, and fluid. Beautiful cross there by Marquez. A nice rally between the two. Fisher digging to the body, going to the legs. Marquez straight up to the top. Nice work there by Fisher, just letting that left hook and left leg. Marquez coming in, trying to step inside. Both of them throwing wide hooks, a knee to the body. A debilitating blow. David Marquez trying to get up. I don't think he has it in him. And it's all over, a first round knockout. Wow. A bludgeoning body blow by David Fisher. Drops and stops David Marquez. And you're looking at your bantamweight title holder. Cool, calm, and collected in the corner. Here's the replay, a beautiful knee to the chest. Yeah, that was in the liver. That's the liver that is shocking him from the inside. When you get hit in that liver, that blood just gushes out and it is just painful. Marquez bending a little bit down, making a perpendicular target for that knee. And that knee finds its mark and boom. A liver quiver from David Marquez connecting to the body of Marquez. Liver quiver by David Fisher. Too many Davids in one fight. <laughs> <laughs> a great fight, man. This one ended short. Well, maybe we could see him run this one back because it was just starting to get good. The death dealer brings it every time. Well, now, David Marquez is the featherweight champion. He's defended that bout. He stepped down in weight to try to contest for this bantamweight title. 
He still retains his featherweight title, but now the bantamweight title goes to David Fisher. You have to give Marquez credit. All right, five fans. Reaching Let's make for this greatness. One official. At one minute and 55 seconds of round number one, your free big Mark Reyes stopped about, declaring your winner by knockout. And now, the fighters rep, West Coast Bantamweight Champion from the black quarter, David Denise Fisher. So after the first two title fights go to decision, the next two end in first round KO. We'll see what the fifth one has in store as Cameron Spencer and Christian Zoller get ready to enter the ring. But first, we'll surely hear from our bantamweight title holder, David Fisher, picked up his 30th right, win in I'm style. I'm with your winner and new fighters rep champion, David Fisher. David. This is your second attempt at a title. You had to go up in weight class, came a little short, dropped to your more of your natural weight class as a fighter, and found gold here. How you feel, champ? I feel amazing, man. I mean, that's the best case scenario right there, that's for sure. Now, let's go over. I believe we have the replay of the knockdown. It, it came out of nowhere. It was a nice knee to the, to the rib cage. Walk us through it. There it is. So he, I noticed he was throwing his loopy hooks, and I saw his... Uh, right hand come over, his body was open, so I just tossed the knee in there. I come from a Muay Thai background, so those knees are pretty, pretty common for me, man. And they came out quick. I mean, honestly, and everyone was like, "What hit him? What hit him?" And you knocked him down, put him out with a count. David Marquez has a huge following here. He is a tough competitor, so the fact that you knocked him down and knocked him out is an amazing accomplishment. What does the future hold for David Fisher here now in the Lions Den? I would definitely like to defend my belt here at Fighters Rep. This is an amazing promotion. Thank you again, George. I don't know where you went, bringing me back up here. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'd definitely like to defend this, and then I'm going to continue fighting. If you don't know, I'm fighting next week in Phoenix, Arizona as well. I'm busy. I'm a dog. I work hard. It's, I'm just going to show you guys what I keep doing. Yeah, honestly, your record, 29, uh, it's probably like 29 and 8, 30 and 8 now. I mean, it is very impressive for an amateur uh, kickboxer. What is motivating you to constantly keep grinding? Like you said, just last week, you fought in a completely different state. Yeah. Well, you just got to keep going. Through the trials and the tribulations, the losses, you just got to keep going, get back to the gym. I have a great coach, a great team, steering me down the right path every time, man. So I'm grateful. And it struck gold for this one. You have a lot of friends, fans, family out here in the Lions Den. What do you have to say to them, champ? Uh, thanks to everyone back home who bought the live stream and tuned in. Thanks to my family for coming out here. And Dada for sure gave me the gave me the Phoenix PD hat. You gotta represent right there. But thanks, thanks for the thanks for the support. I appreciate it. And there you go. And thank you. Your champion and winner, David D. Nice Fisher.